I'm Glenn. Today, oh. I'm Glenn. Today we're fishing in the rain for halibut, and I think I just got one. I got one. I got one. I'm going to show you guys. He's not a keeper. And all I do is just nice and slow, just drop it in the bottom, make sure it's behind you 10 yards or whatever, and just, and it went boop. Yeah, they're all through here. I'm saying this is just one big sand flat. Oh, let me get I've got, no, no, you're good. I've got reverse. Um, but this is like a typical size, you know what I mean? 12, 14 inches. These are the small ones. But like, that, that's all it is, is they're just laying around in here all over the place. Just drag it on the bottom and they'll bite it. Time for you to go, buddy. Off he goes. Hold on, hold on, he's right there, you're good. That is... A little baby halibut you got. <laughs> yeah, you got a little halibut. Um, all right, uh, just kind of swing him out of the way. I'm gonna go grab you, and then what you can do is hold on one second. You're fine. Oh no, I'll okay. get you. Okay. Um, what you can do is let some line out. There you go. That's good. Now just lift the pole up over your head, straight up almost. Okay. No, 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 not lift. Oh. Just lift the tip. <laughs> there you go. Right on, sister. That's awesome. <laughs> Hang on, though, so he doesn't go, uh, just put him in the boat for a second, okay. and we'll get the hook out of him. Yeah. Now, what you want to do, yeah, no, no, it's okay, just let it go. Okay. And then, oh, man, I think he might be gut hooked. That's okay, we'll cut it and put a new hook on him. So that's what we'll do. Is, yeah, we're not even going to try and do anything crazy with him. And just set that over there in the little rod holder behind you, see the little hole? So it's out of the way. Boom. And then... You hold them just like this. Just no back of the tail like that, like a little taco. And then put your other hand underneath him. Underneath? Okay. Yep, there you go. Are you taking a picture? Yeah, I'm taking a video. <laughs> Look at Jill with her first little Hallie. Little 12 incher. Looks like you got gut hooked, so whenever you want to throw him back in. Just give him a yeah, just throw him like right in here. <laughs> Boom! Off he went. We lost our oar. <laughs> Oh, mine, I think it fell off over oh. there. Oh, I'll go get it. Okay. Good job. Awesome. Now I got to retie your hook real quick. Give me one second. Yeah. Okay. Is it fighting straight up and down or kind of shaking its head? Halibut? Nice. Hang on one second. Depending on how big he is. Oh, he looks like he might have a little, he might be a little pissed off. I'm just going to throw this in the back of your boat. Oh yeah, no, he's decent size. Um, you could probably just kind of lift the pole over your head like straight up, bring him to you and grab the line and go boop and plop him right in. And just kind of one smooth whoop and they usually plop right in. Slam! Let some line out. And then you can stick the rod holder in the, behind you on your right. There you go. And then get him through with all 
that crap out of your way. Oh, you have pliers in there, brother. You don't want him to jump and put that thing in your finger. Oh, there you go. The man with the plan. He's like, now, who's in charge? <laughs> Boom. Right now, if you want to hold them up, hey, and then I'll get a picture with you. Not bad. Boom shakalaka. You're going on Insta and YouTube. You can just flip them over or you can take some pictures or if you want to get Bada bang! How are you guys doing on bait? You guys both have plenty of bait? Oh, yeah.